what is up everybody i am walking back to the creek and it is a gorgeous gorgeous day it's memorial day weekend i am going for some brook trout haven't caught them yet in vermont but hopefully today is going to be the day it's nice and warm the sun is shining i'm going to a creek that i think is going to have them um, and we're going to see if we can get some brook trout are vermont state fish and they're super pretty super awesome and hopefully we can show you how pretty they are uh, if i can catch a couple so let's catch some fish there we go there's a fish what do we got what do we got let's go we got our first brookie gorgeous look at that brook trout gorgeous looking brook trout up here in this little nice little pool nothing anything crazy big but it's my first one first brook trout in vermont state fish this kind of looks a little drab but you can still kind of see the colors on them really pretty colors on these on these brook trout let's go ahead and release it oh there's another one nice looking brook trout let's go oh they're feisty in this little little hole right here gorgeous looking brook trout look at that fish really pretty looking brook trout love these fish they've got that awesome halo colors of them love their fins bottom side you can see that white on those fins the anal fin and then the pelvic fins super pretty fish look at that Gorgeous brook trout. Let's get the release on it. Oh, there's one. Yep, another another one out of this little hole. Oh, gorgeous looking brook trout. Floppy little devil. Brook trout again, another one of them. Fun to catch, really pretty. I mean, look at that fish. Oh, there's one. Yep, another brookie. Awesome. Look at that brook trout. What a gorgeous looking brook trout. Gosh. I mean, you cannot beat a fish like that. Mr. Brook Trout, go on your way. Ooh, there's one. Yep, another brook trout. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. This one's the tail has got a little messed up, but still super pretty see a brookie all right i finally got my first brook trout i'm stoked it was out of this little river what we're gonna do is we're gonna see if we can find a bigger one so we're gonna go to another river check out that spot i think it's a little bit higher in the mountains and it's gonna have more potholes so it might be the river we can get a couple bigger ones but i am stoked i got a couple this is really cool i'm just gosh brook trout are like one of my favorite fish of all time all right i totally have a creamy problem um i'm addicted to these so much it's gonna fuel me up to catch more brook trout i got a maple creamy but i also this is so bad i got a pint of maple creamy ice cream that i'm gonna eat also oh it's gonna be a sugar overload but i love it so much thank you so much and shout out to palmer's maple lane best creamies in vermont you gotta check them out all right here we go this is gonna be, actually be a challenge for anyone out there. I took down a large maple creamy and now I'm going on the pint. You can see it right here. A whole pint of ice cream, I just started on it. I wanna see if anybody else likes ice cream as much as I do. If you guys do it, uh, this is called the maple creamy challenge. One whole pint of ice cream and a large maple cone. And after that, you gotta go do some brook trout fishing. So it's the, uh, the maple creamy challenge. Graham's way. Oh my lord, I just totally finished whew, that pint of ice cream. That was mapley, that was delicious, it was amazing. That's the challenge. One large maple creamy and then one large pint of maple creamy ice cream. You gotta finish it. Go catch some brook trout. And that is the Graham's maple creamy challenge. Let's see if you can do it. We made it to the second stream. This one's really pretty also. It's Hopefully gonna have some nice deep pools and hopefully gonna have some brook trout in it. I'm all sugar rushed up. That maple creamy ice cream is getting me all excited. There we go, there's one. Let's go. And look at how small that fish is. 
really small brook trout. It's kind of the name of the game today is just catching a bunch of small fish. Really pretty fish though. I mean, that is gorgeous, gorgeous little brook trout. We completed the challenge, ate a bunch of maple creamies, caught a brook trout, which is awesome. Now the goal is to try to get a little bit bigger of brook trout. We gotta get some bigger ones. This stream is really cool. It's not huge, but it's got the high mountain water flow. This is really cold. This is exactly what brookies want. Um, so we're gonna keep on going to see if we can get any of these bigger pools and hopefully get a couple of bigger fish. There's one. That's a nice fish right there. That's, that's a good brookie. That's a nicer brookie right there. This is the ones we're looking for. These bigger brookies, let's see if we can get them on the... Oh, that is gorgeous. Look at that fish. Probably the biggest one of the day. In this nice little pool right here. Oh my gosh. I mean, the colors on that fish are absolutely gorgeous. There's one. Yep, another brookie. Just little pockets, these little pools. Just see if they're in there. Oh, there's one. Oh, it's a bigger fish. Let's go. That is a nice one. That is a nice brookie. That is the brookie of the day. That is a gorgeous looking brook trout. I mean, oh my Lord. Just in that little pool right there, he was just hanging out in these little stair-stepping pools. Gorgeous looking fish. This is looking a little juicy. This little run right here, it's really kind of skinny, but I'm sure there's a fish or two hanging out in here. Look at this guy. I just saw it emerging right now. A little some kind of something. Some kind of dragonfly. There's one. Yep. Let's get him right into the bucket. Perfect. Look at that beautiful brook trout. There's one. All right, we gotta land this one. Jeez. Another nice brook trout. This one's a little bit drab. Pretty fish. We'll release it. There's one. That's a nicer fish. Let's get him in. There. Oh. Look at that fish. Beautiful, beautiful colors. Oh my gosh, this one's got the, the purple halos and the red spots. There we go, there's one. Oh my gosh, what a gorgeous looking fish. Brook trout number one out of the dream hole. Gorgeous looking brook trout. Nice in this little hole. There's one. Yep. Brookie. Give me a bucket. Woo! We got a brookie. Very nice. Come walk it over. Look at that. Gorgeous looking brook trout. Beautiful fish. Right here up in the mountains. Native brook trout. Gorgeous. Hit the release. Awesome. There's one. Yep. It's a little bit same size as the ones we've been getting. There we go. There's one. Cut it sink to the bottom and I felt tap, tap, tap. This is a really, really pretty one. Look at that beautiful, beautiful brook trout. I mean, gorgeous, gorgeous looking fish. There's one. Yep, nice in this little, this little hole right here. Gorgeous in this little fast water. Just kind of sitting up in there and smoked it. Another beautiful, beautiful brook trout. Look at those fins on it. I love the fins. And you just cannot beat their fins. Yep, there he is. That's another one. Wow, that one's really pretty too. The colors on this one's awesome looking. I mean, that has got to be the colors of the day. Look at those oranges. The oranges on it is just gorgeous. This, this looks like a nice, deeper hole. It's exactly what we want for these brookies. 
There's one. That's a good one. That one could be the fish of the day. Yep, 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 yep. Stay on, stay on, stay on. That is the fish of the day, everyone. I mean, my lord. Probably a, I'm not really good at sizing these things up, but oh my gosh. What a gorgeous looking fish. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous fish. You can get an underwater shot of it. There's one. Yep, he's not huge, but it's a brook trout. Any brook trout is good brook trout in my mind. Probably the smallest one of the day, but still a pretty fish. There we go, there's, a, there's one. Nice little brookie, small guy, but still fun. See ya. Ah, small one. <laughs> small but mighty. There we go, this hole is producing. Oh nice, it popped right off the hook, that's great. They're so feisty, they'll just pop right off. Gorgeous, gorgeous little fish. Fun sized, back he goes. There's one. Not the biggest one, but a brook trout nonetheless. So fun to catch, this, this hole is absolutely loaded. Gorgeous little brook trout, small one. That feels like a better fish for sure. That is a better fish, let's go. Longer fish, nice looking fish. Release him back in there, goodbye. That's a small one right there. Could be the smallest brook trout of the day. Look at you, cutie. I can't really think of a better day. I just feel like the bigger ones in the pool are always there and they bite first and they're just kind of ready to go. There, there's one. That one's hooked up pretty good. Wow, is that a brown? That's like a, holy moly, look at the color on this one. I mean, look at the darkness on those. That's a dark colors on this bro brook trout. Yeah, this one's definitely the darkest one of the day. Holy moly. All right, back you go. Small one. I feel like the small ones get hooked better for some reason. Little small baby brook trout. See ya, bud. So there's a huge waterfall coming up right here. I wonder if there's gonna be brook trout above the waterfall. It'd be kind of cool to see if there was, and just to see how far they really travel up through this water system. Ooh, there's one. Oh, beautiful fish. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my gosh. Holy crap, I almost just noodled it. So there, there's fish at least up to the waterfall. There's one, really pretty one again. Very nice. Small little brookie up in this little spot. All right, so we know there's fish in this little pool going up, but are there fish above the waterfalls? We're gonna check it out. All right, so we just made it up the falls a little bit right here. And then it kind of stair-stepped up to this little waterfall a nice deep pool i'm thinking there's going to be fish in here but there's only one way to figure it out and we're going to see these tanks are really handy for when you catch fish you just throw them right in there and they stay in the water when you unhook these fish which is nice yep there's one feels like a better fish for sure oh it is a better one look at that up this little waterfall and there's a brook trout just sitting in it right there gorgeous looking brook trout these fish definitely disperse throughout the stream and wow, that could be the prettiest one of the day. There's one. Beautiful one too. Look at how pretty that fish is. Gorgeous looking brook trout. Nice deep pool right there where we caught a couple. Let's go up the waterfall. Looks like there's another little pool right here. We're gonna give it a go. Do not fall down the waterfall, Graham. Oh, that's a, that feels like a better fish for sure. Yes, it is, it's a nice one. Gorgeous looking fish. Beautiful brook trout, we're releasing back up here. All right, so it's stair stepping. This could be the best pool that I've seen all day. This is gonna have some fish in it for sure. This is like the secret honey hole 
I'm so excited about this. All right, first cast. There's one, yep. First cast, very successful first cast. Look at that fish. We'll release him downstream out of this beautiful hole. That's the first. Let's see if we can get more. There's one. Nice fish. I saw that fish hit. Oh my gosh, two casts, two fish. Especially pretty. Wow. All right, back you go. All right, two for two. Can we go three for three? There's third. Three for three, this might, oh, he popped off. We were technically three for three, just, I didn't land it. Small one. Wow, smallest one of the day. Well, we know the recruitment's doing good. This is just the par. You can see the par marks on this fish. These little striations, the um, vertical lines down on the fish. Uh, yeah, those are the par marks. So this is just a smaller, smaller brook trout, not big, juvenile. But we know the recruitment's doing good, so that's good. Ooh, okay, that feels like a better fish. Nice little gorgeous brookie. Oh, there's a fish. Yep, look at that. Let's get him in our little bucket. Nice little brook trout back into its hole. There we go, there's a fish. Nice brookie, as soon as it hit the water. Nice little pool right here, has nice little brookies. I mean, you just can't, you can't beat that. We'll release them. See you later, fishy. Yep, there's one, that's a better one. Yeah, that's a nice one. That's a beautiful brook trout, oh my lord. Look at that fish, I mean, that is gorgeous. What a gorgeous looking brook trout. It does not get better than that, everyone. I'm having, almost too much fun. This one's pretty fat too. <laughs> that one was eating. What an awesome day. Oh my gosh. Memorial Day weekend. I don't think I'd spend it any other way. Brook trout fishing and also doing the Graham's Maple Creamy Challenge. That was absolutely delicious. I'm gonna go ahead and challenge anyone that watches this video to try the Graham's Maple Creamy Challenge. It was pretty tricky. It was a lot of ice cream, but it just gives you the energy to go catch some brook trout and hike around and through these beautiful streams, so. I just wanna say thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate everyone's support along the way. Making these videos has been so fun for me and really just highlighting species like the brook trout and native fish species and other wildlife throughout my channel has been really a lot of fun and I, I love it each time. This is what I wanna do. I just wanna be outside all the time and, and show everybody how cool the outdoors can actually be. I mean, so many different places to explore, so much to see, so much cool wildlife, so. Again, I appreciate everyone's support and we'll see everybody next time.